Sneed, to answer your question, I think that next year is actually going to be the millimeter wave renaissance for AT&T because of the cash infusion, the significant cash infusion, Sneed, man, yeah. that is going to happen. I mean, we're talking about every CRAN, millimeter wave upgrades. We're talking about macro sites, millimeter wave upgrades. It's a lot of money coming in, man. Yeah. But again, we've talked about this, Sneed, man. Millimeter wave on a macro, very crazy, right? It's a very directional, very, I mean, the signal's going to dissipate already by the time it gets to the ground, right? I mean, we we were talking to a buddy of ours. He's saying T-Mobile is going to be putting millimeter wave after N41. So the, the, the way that it's going is band 71 upgrade potentially a band 41 upgrade after that, or at the same time. And then they're going to be putting millimeter wave on a T-Mobile cell site. But again, the millimeter wave only travels so far. So it's just like directly underneath the macro or a couple feet and, you know, not a couple feet, but you know, maybe like two blocks max. Yeah. Yeah, it's possible. I don't know. I don't like, Personally, I don't like millimeter wave on macros. Maybe if it's a low macro, it's a rooftop site, you know, that's not too tall. But the propagation characteristics of millimeter wave from a really tall site, it's just not not the move, dude. Yeah. It's just not, you know. Like, I've tested it on several sites now, and I don't know, man. I just, it doesn't seem to, because it's such a directional you know, it, it's a very directional connection. So you want it to go to a certain place where there's going to be a lot of people or you need that capacity, right? And when you shoot it from a tower site, it has a tendency to want to, like, spray, right? Where it, like, kind of, the signal kind of, like, widens or whatever. And then the millimeter wave signal just, it, it, it's not... It's not strong. It's not resilient. So you want it to be directional and you want it to be lower so it remains strong. Like you're going to need repeaters if you're going to be deploying for macros. And I don't see T-Mobile investing in repeaters unless they're really, 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 really cheap. Like super ultra cheap, like next to nothing cheap, you know? Yeah. I mean... Millimeter wave just needs to be cheaper, and then it's, it'll be everywhere, right? Yeah. Well, the, the, the issue right now is fiber. It's not really about, like, the sites right now for Verizon, I think, are costing them $17,000. Is it still seventeen? It hasn't gone down? It could be. It could be lower right. now with, with Samsung. Know. Who knows? Oh, man. Imagine if, uh, you know, the, those Koreans, man, they might uh, be coming in hot, man. They want the business. It's true. It's very possible.